This video will show using an Acer Iconia A500 Android tablet to connect to a ScanFob Bluetooth laser barcode scanner and scan barcodes into the Android tablet. First thing we need to do is install the software to communicate with the scanner. This can be done with the Android Market or in this case we're going to use the browser so that we don't have to set up an Android Market account. We're going to go to the Apps area and we're going to go to the Settings. We're going to tap and hold on Settings and drag it to the home screen to make it easier to go in and out of the Settings app. If you don't like the Settings icon there, just tap and hold and move it where you like it. Now we're going to go into the Settings app and we're going to go into Applications and tap Unknown Sources and tap OK. Now we can install the applications using the browser. We're going to install the Serial Magic Gears application. So we're going to go to the SerialIO.com site, tap on Downloads, Serial Magic Downloads. We're going to scroll down to the Android section. Serial Magic is available on many different platforms. And we're going to install the Serial Magic Gears for Android 2.1. Tells us different options for installing. And we can also use this link now that we've enabled alternate sources. Just tap, you get the starting download, and the download is almost immediate. Tap on the notification, then install, and you can open the Serial Magic Gears application. You'll tap Menu in Serial Magic Gears, then Connect. It prompts you to turn on Bluetooth, and then you also want to turn on the Bluetooth radio of the scan fob by holding down the function button for five seconds or scanning the barcode to turn on the radio. Tap scan for devices and then tap on the scan fob when it shows up. It prompts you for the pin code. You enter the pin code of four zeros and tap OK and you're connected to the scanner. You can scan a barcode and you can see it show up in Serial Magic Gears and also the Android tablet, the A500, is very nice in that it has a vibrate feature so you can feel it when it scans. Then we're going to go to the menu options because we want to scan into more than just the Serial Magic Gears app itself. We're going to tap Serial Magic Keys to turn it on. Then we're going to go back to the Settings app, go to Language and Input, and then we're going to go to the current input method and we're going to configure input methods. We're going to tap Serial Magic Keys then tap OK. And then we can go back and select the current input method as Serial Magic Keys. Then we can go to any application like the browser. We'll switch over to another tab which is going to restock.com, which is the list in hand mobile list application. And we can scan a barcode where the cursor is on this application. And we can tap make list. And we have a list of the items we just scanned. You can scan into any application you like. You can create a new tab, for example, and you can go to Google. You can tap in the field and scan a barcode, and it will look it up. For more barcode and RFID scanning solutions, please visit SerialIO.com. Thank you for watching.